As COVID-19 cases continue to rise nationwide, AAA expects travel during the Thanksgiving holiday to drop 10% from a year ago. Good evening, everyone. I'm Matt Breen. Stella is off tonight. KTIV's Hava Para spoke with the president of the Sioux Gateway Airport Board of Trustees to find out what expectations are for local air travel this holiday season in the middle of a pandemic. Dave Bernstein, who's the president of the Sioux Gateway Airport Board of Trustees, says the number of flights going out of Sioux Gateway Airport is off compared to past years, with fewer people planning on traveling for the holiday. Last year, we would have had two flights to Dallas and three flights to Chicago. This year, we're really going to have one to Chicago and one to Denver. He says the airport has added several safety measures to keep travelers safe. Masks are required at the airport and on the planes, and they have hired additional cleaning staff. And, and, and the good thing about our terminal generally that would be different than maybe some more congested terminals is we have a lot of space in that terminal, so people should have plenty of space to be comfortable wherever they're waiting. Bernstein says with the exception of the mask requirement and the limited services on a plane, everything is pretty normal at the airport. Knowing a lot of people, I think, I think the travel experience is um, uh, safer than, than people maybe were expecting and people are starting to get more comfortable with it. I mean, certainly uh, nothing is absolutely safe. But uh, I really believe that, that the airlines have done a wonderful job of keeping that safe. According to Bernstein, recent data shows the transmission of COVID-19 on airplanes with airlines requiring masks is very favorable, meaning there is very low chance of transmission. Reporting in Sioux City, Havapara, KTIV News 4. Although travel is expected to be down this holiday season, Bernstein says travel has actually increased since the pandemic began.